Professor Joseph Pelton of George Washington University is claiming that, well, the risk of the sun taking out the grid should not be underestimated. And not only that, you should have a plan. And this echoes something that we've been saying for a long time in terms of having a plan for such an event. It doesn't have to be man or a nefarious government or whatever that pulls the trigger and sets off an EMP to shut lights out anywhere. It could be the sun and a Carrington event similar to what we've seen in the past where it can fry all types of stuff and send people back to the horse and buggy days. And if you're not prepared for it, it can severely, severely do some damage to societies and to a people. Now, for those out there that aren't accustomed to using all the tech technological gadgets of the day, they'll get by better. Those that are just out there growing, not using computers, kind of living off-grid, they may not even notice anything. If they're just staying to themselves on their farms, now, of course, at some point they will because the outside world, it's going to affect them. People they sell to, communities, people that are starving, losing jobs, all this is going to start to bleed into itself at some point. You're going to have to face people out here that were not prepared. That's got to be a part of your plan too. Now, in this instance, they're talking about this because they're saying that a hole has opened up in the sun's upper atmosphere and that there's been this massive eruption of magnetic energy. Now, when this coronal wind starts to come to Earth, it hits Earth and starts to peel back our magnetic field. It weakens it in different areas. We've also noticed in the past this can have a correlation with earthquake activity. Not only can the solar winds coming in have an effect, but also we've seen other bodies like asteroids making close approaches for some reason or another have some kind of effect to where decent earthquakes pop off. The same has been said with massive alignments that we've seen in our solar system in the past as well. And this is an area that I really think a lot of people need to start drawing up plans for. We're going to be talking about this in great detail. Surviving such an event, it's in my belief, this is the one event that could dismantle everything. It could crash our economy, bring down the dollar, all unexpected. We have all these things from man that they can plot on. But when something comes from the sun out of nowhere, it could change the course of history in the blink of an eye. Better to have a plan and be prepared for such an event than to not have one when it approaches. But make sure to join us every Friday night, Underground World News Live, 8 p.m. Eastern on Dabu 77. And if you want to join us, a bunch of like-minded individuals for the first ever knowledge conference in the Cincinnati area, March 30th, make sure to get a hold of me ASAP because tickets are almost gone and I can't wait for this event get together with a bunch of like-minded individuals and talk about things we can do to prepare for events like this and a whole lot more. This has been Dabu7. Much love, y'all. Eyes to the skies.